mail carriers across the state were out doing their part by picking up doorstep food donations from Mainers participating in the Stamp Out Hunger Food Drive. U.S. Postal Service's National Association of Letter Carriers and Heart of Maine United Way join together each year to collect food donations and tackle food insecurity. New Center Maine's Raya Wu and shares how leaving a single food bag at your doorstep provides meals for thousands of Mainers. This is one of the biggest things every year, and it's neat because it's all across the United States, not just Bangor, Maine. Watch your fingers. U.S. Postal Service's letter carriers walk their routes, delivering mail and picking up small bags of hope. I've only done four walking moves so far, and I must have 20, I've got at least 20 bags in there. Mainers place bags full of food on their doorsteps, donating to the nationwide Stamp Out Hunger Food Drive. Today's going to be a long day. And letter carriers like Thomas Richendoler pack them up in the back of their mail trucks. It's worth it, though. Later dropping them off right here at USPS Eastern Maine Processing and Distribution Center. This is the best part of the day when the stuff comes in. Okay where volunteers sort. Tomato sauce would be over there with the pasta. What do you got? Pasta. Pasta. The partnership between the National Association of Letter Carriers and Heart of Maine United Way combined with efforts from community members like Bill Ray brings helping hands together, giving some families meals they can't afford themselves. People are hungry and the prices of food in the grocery store, as you and I both know, have gone up. So to make a choice between paying your rent buying a gallon of milk for your kids, that's a hard choice. It's not who we might picture. It's really many of our neighbors, many of our coworkers uh, that might be on the brink. They might be one crisis away from struggling. The Bangor site collects about 30,000 pounds of food each year, equating to approximately 25,000 meals. Those meals get distributed to local food pantries. And this is why I do it. I'm 74 years old, but I don't want to quit. And as long as God gives me breath, I'm going to keep on going. In Bangor, Rai Wooden, New Cinemang.